this video, we will go to the basics of wiring the access in a box components and accessories. For this installation, we have a lock, a door position sensor, request to exit button, and a reader. I have pre-wired these for greater simplicity. Before we begin, please make sure the power cable is unplugged. When wiring the power supply, connect the live wire to the live terminal, the neutral wire to the neutral terminal, and the earth to the earth terminal. Leave the power cable unplugged. I have two wires coming from the request to exit button and two wires coming from the door sensor. Connect a wire from the request to exit button with a wire from the door sensor together. These will be connected to the common ground. Take the other wire from the request to exit button and connect it to the terminal block location labeled RTE. Take the other wire from the door sensor and connect it to the terminal block location labeled DPS. Correctly match the three terminals on the SIR reader terminal blocks to the corresponding terminal connectors. I have used a standard Mylar cable with three colors to match those of the S-Pass connector. Red for positive, black for negative, and green for data. Plug the corresponding colored plug into the matching terminals for positive, negative, and data on the reader module. For the purpose of this demo, I have selected a fail-safe bolt lock. In a fail-safe mode, the door is unlocked when power is removed. It is highly recommended to use a separate power supply for door accessories. On the relay connector, the positive wire from the lock is connected to the common terminal. A jumper wire is connected to the normally closed terminal. The other end of the jumper wire is connected to the positive power terminal of the separate power supply for the door lock. The negative wire from the lock is connected to the negative power terminal of the separate power supply. Now that the system is wired, do a quick check on the wiring. If everything is OK, plug in the power cable. Now that we got the unit powered up, let's test the system. Congratulations, you have successfully wired your access in a box. Now to connect and configure your system, watch the connectivity video and basic functions video.